In this week's Midwest Spotlight, we are talking tough rankings questions heading into the upcoming 2024 and 2025 rankings refresh. And one of the biggest I have is what do we do with this talented group of Midwest 2024 receivers? Uh, there are eight of the receivers from the region that are in the rivals 250 right now. Now, Texas commit Ryan Wingo sits atop the group as the only five star. And while he isn't the most college ready of the group right now, he has a rare combination of size and speed, likely giving him the most upside should he reach his ceiling. Now, Wingo is followed right behind by Ohio State commit Mylon Graham, who's a slippery route runner, has the speed to take the top off, and then Notre Dame commit Cam Williams, whose development has been absolutely remarkable over the past year. Both of those guys have an argument for the top receiver in the region and are pushing Wingo. Georgia commit Nitro Tuggle is next, and he's a big play machine waiting to happen. One of the more complete players of this group, and he's followed by closely by Jeremiah McClellan, who one could easily argue is probably the most college-ready receiver of the group and maybe the surest thing of this talented group of Midwest receivers. Michigan State commit Nicholas Marsh. Michigan commit Amarion Stewart and Wisconsin commit Kyan Barry Johnson round out this top group of rivals 250 pass catchers from the region. Now, Marsh is a physical specimen, had a phenomenal senior season. Stewart is likely underrated as well, despite his lofty ranking. And, you know, he may have had the most dominant performance I saw in person this season of the receivers. Barry Johnson, the Wisconsin commit, he could end up being the most productive out of the entire group as he is a slot machine. He will catch a ton of balls, catches everything he comes his way. But it's a good problem to have for the region. The hard part is, you know, where do they all stack up?